we just finished dropping off the kids and it's just me and my husband in the car and we're actually on the way to my surprise five year anniversary. Yep. He has planned this, I think he planned this Saturday, I'm not really sure, but I'm really excited. And now he's just driving. Like I said, we just dropped the kids off. It's about a 40 minute drive. Well, we gotta get some food first. Yes, we're gonna stop and get some food first. We're going to this Portuguese wine and grill place. And I've been there before and my husband's been there, but he's only been there, I think, once. And one time before when we got married, we actually had our dinner reception there. So it's pretty exciting that we're going back for our five year anniversary. So when I get there, I will show you the food. We do have about a 30 minute drive, so it might be a while when we get there, but I will show you my food and the place. No, profess it, scream it. I love you. some delicious food as you guys can tell and my dessert was literally hot fire but I really didn't like it too much I like the coconut flan much better baby how'd you like your food it's amazing he was really hesitant good. because it is a Portuguese restaurant and last time he was there was a long time ago but he actually ended up really liking it like nothing left in his plate liking it <laughs> that's the story of like all the restaurants you know he's always hesitant to go to new places he doesn't like to try new things but when he does he loves it so we are 2.3 miles is that what it says 2.3 miles away from where at and i guessed it again like i do every single time he plans something for me i always guess it and we are going on a helicopter ride i'm so excited i've always wanted to do it he's been on a helicopter ride so he's been on it but i don't think he's ever been like a regular helicopter without being tactical so we're really excited and we're getting there and i just can't wait to do it All right, this is cool. See? Easy peasy. You didn't lowball your weight, did you? <laughs> no, I'm <been> playing around. <laughs> now, does our headsets work? I'm so scared. Do you have tears in your eyes? Can you? <laughs> What a life, right? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Thank you. 
so scared. There is tears in his eyes. I'm pretty sure you guys caught that. And this is what he looks like now. Oh, oh man. He's that ready was... to unwind. You want to get some coffee, baby? Yeah, that was that was scary. I don't like highs at all. I don't. That was great, baby. Yeah. Give me a kiss. Happy five year anniversary. Give me another kiss. Mm. And another one. I ordered on the go, Stacy. So this is how we end all our dates with our Duncan. I like four splines, four creams. He likes six and six. Today we want to just end our vlog with just one word or sentence, whatever he has in mind, whatever I have, and how we just continue to grow our marriage and how we have lasted five years in our marriage. A lot of people don't last in relationships, let alone marriages, but I'm going to tell you what I think. And honestly, my word to my husband, knowing him, knowing us, and knowing the word of God. Respect is the biggest thing when it comes to my marriage with my husband between me and him because it's his the respect of his position, the respect of his opinion, the best choices he has for my family and our family. I always respect, well, most of the time I respect, but I always try to respect him for the most part. <laughs> but that's what I always try to have my main focus point is the respect I have towards him, the respect I have towards my family. And that's what I think when it comes to my marriage and I really feel like that is why we have such a loving, joyful, fun mm -hmm. marriage. And it just continues. And the longer we're together, the more we love each other. And I know that's like cliche and cheesy, but my honeymoon stage is just starting. I love my husband more, mm -hmm. so much more now than I ever have before. So, baby, what do you think? What's the number one word? You're going to make me cry. <laughs> <laughs> What's the number uh, one? For me, it's forgiveness. Uh, forgiveness because there's always going to be issues there's always going to be problems there's always going to be a fight life is not easy there's always going to be complications in life and, and a bunch of stuff but we gotta we gotta remember at the end of the day we gotta forgive each other and continue uh with the next day because again it's always going to happen you know there's always going to be issues so forgiveness is is a big one. Oh yeah and you have fun Oh, I had a, such a she great had a, She had a blast watching me freak out. It was flying. such a... It was I, hilarious, yeah, right? Yeah, that tear in your eye at mm. one point. At one point, the helicopter, like, turned like this. And I'm, like, looking straight <laughs> down. And his, he was, like, beet red and, like, glossy eyes. It was hilarious. We and the, such funny, a great the time. funny thing, the two, the pilots were prior Marines. And I'm a prior yeah, Marine. Yeah, they had that instant connection. So we, we were messing around with each other and, you know... He was saying they had to fix the duct tape. I was yeah. like, that's not even funny. <laughs> but like I said, this is how we always end our dates. And we'll see you in our next vlog. Bye.